I've been writing plays about people who had nothing. I mean, Blue Leaves was about people who were, had nothing, financially, emotionally, intellectually. They just had dreams and they had nothing else. And I wanted to write a play, I guess, about, because I felt, gee, for the first time in my life, I had some money. I mean, it was amazing. You know, I felt, uh, it was amazing. And I wrote it one where people had, who had everything and what happened to them. Because Philip Barry wrote plays about, that's what a high comedy is, I remember from my college thesis. A high comedy was a comedy not based on need, but people who had everything. And then, so I said, oh, well, I'll, I want to write a Philip Barry play. And uh, I just set it on an iceberg and it seemed to be very nice, where you could control reality, a completely controlled environment. And uh, people with uh, big dreams, and what people who had all the, who had everything at their command, how they were still stymied by fear, that fear was still the doubt, no matter what you had, no matter what excuses you had, or excuses, you know, say, oh, I have nothing, and then we'll say, I have everything, that still fear is at the heart of everything. The play was such a magnet, I could put so many things into the play, that uh, um, I didn't want to let go of it. I was afraid to let go of it, and uh, I thought I could shine it into something perfect. Uh, but. I learned that there's no such thing as a perfect play, that you have to know when to let it go, warts and all.